When I was younger, I always wanted to be an, a president. I always want to lead people because that's what I feel. But when I started to become older, like going to primary, I started to change my mind. I'm going to be a doctor. I said I'm going to be an engineer. And I kind, it kind of it was like kind of confusing to me. But when I reached say, secondary, with the help of uh, CUDA, and RCPS, it helped me to find my hidden treasures. It reminded me that when I was young, I always wanted to be a leader, and it all kind of changed my life. So CUDA helped me to, to remember and to put in action what I'm going to be in future. But by the assessments I've done, I found that I'm going to be uh, enterprising. I scored high on enterprising. Enterprising, it's all about leading and selling your ideas. So it made me choose the right section I'm going to study in the future. Sometimes I just sit down and ask me what you're going to be. I'm like, I'm going to be a president. And they're like, do you think your dreams are going to come true? And I'm like, by the help of God, by the help of anyone near me, my friends, I think I'm going to achieve that. Why do we need to have this career guidance within the education system? I think when a, a kid goes to school at those uh, uh, very early years of education system, they have got some dreams and aspirations. But most of the time, uh, when these kids, they graduate from education system, joining the employment uh, workforce, not all of them, they become happy with what they pursued to do. So in order to have these kids not being disappointed at the end of their education journey, we need to prepare them much, much, much earlier so that those wishes, dreams, aspirations, they are kept alive until when they graduate. And after graduation, they will be doing something which they will love doing most. And in so doing, it will increase the productivity in whatever they do. And when you increase the productivity, definitely you spur economic growth and development. As headmaster, first of all, I would like to see that uh, those students who come here succeed. And uh, they can only succeed if they know where they are going, where they are from, where they are and where they are going, and what's the future. The future is to see that they are successful in their studies, and I think with this uh, CUDA career guidance, if it is exposed to all schools, our work will be simple or simpler, because students will know what they are doing, even it will also uh, alleviate the problem of indiscipline cases in schools, because some study without interest. They are bored, but if they know where they are, what they, they like what they are taking, they have interest in what they are studying, they can easily know where, what they are likely to occupy in the future. This system is a very good thing. It's a system which helps us to know what we are, who we are, what's our potential, and this is going to help you to be, to be what you want, not what your parents are forcing you to be, to be who you are. This is your potential. This is what you have to do. It's you. It's all about you. If I give you an example, I didn't know who I am for real. I wanted to be this one, be this one, be this one. I was not stable. It showed me who I am. And if I know that I have that potential, I have to do it. Therefore, I'm, I'm, I'm confident that this is what I am and this is what I'm going to do. Well, I'd say the, this good system is good because it actually helps you to better understand yourself, better assess yourself, and with that, you know your strengths, you know your weaknesses, you know your opportunities, you understand your abilities, and through that you're able to explore the options which are there, and then you understand which option or which career which would be best for you as according to how you know yourself, how your strengths, all your weaknesses, all your abilities, which can match a certain career. If there's one thing that's going to help the students 
or even the uh, employers, not only the employees, it's this system. Because this is what Rwanda needs. This is what really the government or the people of Rwanda that needed to really develop. It's actually like gold. <laughs> it's as precious as gold because it's, if there's one good thing, it's doing something which you know. As they say, you can see what you become, but you can't become what you cannot see. So it helps you to see who you are and actually predict what you can do and what you will do.